Alright everyone, Pala back again with some more Hogwarts today. Let's head right into it. So, in the last episodes we joined the House of Ravenclaw and learned from Professor Weasley that we should attend Dark Arts against Defense Against the Dark Arts and Charms class. And we talked to a girl that asked us to discover the painting secret. Rebellion. So there's something about it. But nothing I can see for now. Maybe lighten it up. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Okay, so a uh, man with a huge belly and two pots next to stairs. Right, let's find out where it is. Not here. So here are a lot of stairs. Ooh, hidden entrance. Nice. Give me this chest. Crimson Quidditch gloves. Oh, uh, how do I equip them? Okay, it's like around here. No, gear. Gear looks good. Handwear. Got those. Two offense, defense. No trade. Um, Alright. Case where what do I have here? The glasses. Don't want them. Headwear. A dark flat cap? <laughs> no, not at all. Neckwear. Except a scarf. Nope. It's not cold outside. Have a look. That's what I'm wearing. The outfit. Alright. Nothing else unlocked yet. 200 health, 2 offense, 0 defense. Sounds good. Perfect for hard mode. Can do more damage, but can't tank anything. Right, let's have a look around. To find the statue. Rebellion. Just in case. Who are you? No one of interest. Nothing for my feet here. Yes, this ringing. Can just go through here. Okay, this door's locked. Ghost? Oh. Here's something I can reveal. Three sisters belts. Three sisters belts are said to be a tribute to three similarly named beautiful steep riches that rise majest majestically over Glen and Argyleshire. Okay. Hands me some experience as well. A free flame. Another chest, runic rope. Love it. And still locked. Thieves. Rebellion. Give me a guide. Goblin artifact. Horns like this were used by goblins during 1612. Goblin rebellion to rally troops and generally annoy witches and wizards. Interesting. Level two. This one's not locked. <laughs> okay, I really must attend to the classes, but I want to find the statue. Really? Also, alright. It's locked. This is lock not locked. Oh, the garden. So the field guide here. Wyvern Fountain. This fountain is this the Transfiguration Courtyard has a likeliness of a wyvern on top and serves as a relaxing place for students to gather. Interesting. So let's run around a little. Can I level up now? That's the question. Talents are not unlocked. But I found another rope. Runic rope. Three offense and some health. I really don't know how to level up yet, so talents are locked. Inventory collections. No. We'll check it out later. Rebellion. Nothing around here. 
All right. No chests. So I can enter here. Back here. 21 and 17. I really don't know what this, this means. This looks like the location from the painting. Yes. Could be something special about it. Statue of Gregory the Smarmy. The statue with an aggregation. Ingregating. Ing Fuck. <laughs> Alright. It's Gregory the Smarmy. Who is it famous for inventing Gregory's uncle? Yeah, no. There's this little fellow. Can't do anything with you yet. Let's oh. get you back to your frame, Mr. Moth. Oh, all right. The moth just needed a lamb. And <laughs> right. I knew there was a connection. I should tell the Nora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. First puzzle solved. So where's Laura? Lenora, where can I find you? There? What you asked me to do? Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? Oh. I found the location depicted in the painting and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. Pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is Amit, although he does tend to over-explain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. Well, of course, I'm a, I'm a Ravenclaw and need to solve riddles. Rebellion. Oh, what regalia? Oh, interesting. Can I equip it? Okay, it's not really unlocked. It's gear. Alright, finished another quest, so now I can tend to the Dark Arts. They're here, right? Yes. Tell me if you'd like to... How do I get there? Is there a chest? Oh, damn. I won't be making any progress right now. Just running around, solving riddles. That's really neat. Sorry if I'm late to class. I had to solve some riddles. Up here. What are you looking at? Never seen a guy with white hair. Let's start the class then. you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces in your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso. A levitation charm. Levioso. A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity. Especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned. Starting with something small. Alright. Levioso. So, head here. Go up there. The local speedster. Levioso. I'm so talented. <laughs> so it's like Vingardium Leviosa. Now, let's try something a little larger. <laughs> Levioso. 
Let us begin with a basic cost. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprise good. That's well done. Levioso. Ooh. Very good. But the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel. Using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. All right. Slytherin. I know. This can't be your first duel. Hey. Let's just say I'm a quick. You were good. Now the second one. I do enjoy my features. Oh. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. Arrogant Slytherin. I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Ravenclaw. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. Right. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. So she's telling me I have to practice every time I can, so class is dismissed. I shall run around and lift things up to push them away. Alright. Oh, I'm not much for dueling. I prefer to keep things friendly. I Another system. Professor Hackett in a duel. Wanna be lifted? You've dueled Sebastian. He's strong competition. Well done. Okay, so there's a hidden room. Professor, probably. Rebellion. Let's reveal something. Oh, up there. That was it. A field guide. Don't disappear right now. Okay, it's the skeleton she was talking about. Nice work. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. In fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. Be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires intention and talent. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Sure. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck, or actual skill. 